Have you ever wondered how roller coasters stay on track, even when they flip upside down? You're soaring through the air at breakneck speed, twisting, looping, and plunging toward the ground, yet the train never falls off. Is it magic? Some kind of invisible force? The truth is even cooler. It's a perfect mix of physics, engineering, and smart design, all working together to keep you safe while delivering the ultimate thrill. A roller coaster doesn't have an engine to keep it moving. Instead, it relies on the energy it gains from the very first climb. As the chain lift or launch system pulls the train up the highest hill, it builds up potential energy, the energy of position. The moment the coaster crests that hill and starts to drop, potential energy transforms into kinetic energy, the energy of motion. Gravity takes over, pulling the train downward and keeping it in motion throughout the rest of the ride. But energy alone isn't enough to keep the train safely on the track. That's where the wheels come in. Unlike a regular train, which simply rolls along its rails, a roller coaster has a special three-wheel system that locks it onto the track. The running wheels sit on top of the rails, supporting most of the weight. The side wheels grip the track from the sides, preventing the train from shifting left or right during sharp turns. And the most important ones? The upstop wheels, which sit underneath the track. These prevent the train from lifting off, even when it goes upside down or over sudden drops. Without them, high-speed turns and loops would be impossible. Loops are one of the most exciting parts of a roller coaster, and they work because of inertia, gravity, and those upstop wheels. When the train enters a loop at high speed, its momentum keeps it moving forward and upward. Gravity tries to pull the train down, but as long as it has enough speed, it completes the loop. At the very top, riders might feel weightless, but the upstop wheels keep the train firmly attached to the track. Engineers design loops in a teardrop shape rather than a perfect circle to make the transition smoother and reduce extreme forces on the riders. As the ride nears its end, the train needs to slow down safely. Unlike a car, roller coasters don't have brakes on their wheels. Instead, the brakes are built into the track itself. Many modern coasters use magnetic brakes, which slow the train smoothly and without friction. This ensures that even after all the high-speed thrills, the ride comes to a controlled stop. A common roller coaster myth is that a train can get stuck upside down. In reality, that's nearly impossible. The momentum needed to enter a loop almost always carries the train through, and the upstop wheels ensure it stays locked to the track. And here's a mind-blowing fact. The fastest roller coaster in the world reaches 149 miles per hour, faster than a Formula One car. Next time you ride a roller coaster, pay close attention to the track and wheels. Can you spot the upstop wheels in action? Have you ever felt that weightless sensation at the top of a loop? Let us know your favorite roller coaster experiences in the comments. And if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like and subscribe for more thrilling science content. Got a question about how something really works? Drop it in the comments and we might cover your topic in our next video.